Hello avid watchers and welcome back to the channel. In today's news, US President Donald Trump on Monday threatened to pull America out of the World Health Organization and permanently stop US funding for the world body if it did not commit to major substantive improvements in the next 30 days. Underlying Washington's escalating fight with Beijing, Trump said the WHO needs to show independence from China. He earlier labeled the WHO as a puppet of China. In a letter to WHO Director General, Trump accused the organization of repeated missteps in responding to the pandemic. Trump shared a letter on Twitter hours after Chinese President Xi Jinping addressed the WHO's governing body, the World Health Assembly, by video link. Xi promised to devote two billion US dollars towards fighting the pandemic over the next two years. WHO head Tedros later said that he would keep leading the global fight against the pandemic. Commenting on Trump's letter, Chinese Foreign Ministry spokesman Xiao Lejing has said it was full of insinuations and aims to mislead the public and achieve the purpose of stigmatizing China's epidemic control efforts while shirking its own responsibility. He has said the US has an obligation to pay the full WHO membership fee. Arbitrarily cutting funding to an international organization is unilateralistic behavior, Xiao said. We urge the US to stop passing the buck and deepen international cooperation. In the letter, Trump wrote, It is clear repeated missteps by you and your organization in responding to the pandemic have been extremely costly for the world. The only way forward to the organization is, is if it can actually demonstrate independence from China. He also wrote that if the WHO does not commit to major substantive improvements within the next 30 days, I will make my temporary freeze on US funding permanent and re reconsider our membership. Later, when Trump was asked about the reforms he wants the WHO to carry out, he said, They have to clean up their act. They have to do a better job. They have to be much more fair to other countries, including the US, or we are not going to be involved with them anymore, and we will go our separate ways. The US president had suspended US funding for the WHO at more than 400 million US dollars annually in April. The US has exited a number of world bodies and pacts during Trump's tenure, starting with the Trans-Pacific Partnership in 2017. It was followed by departures from Paris Accord, UNESCO, Iran Nuclear Deal and UNHCR. That is all for today's news. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next video.